love bubbles here at Bloom and we do them every week in our class for very good reason. So those slow moving bubbles are going to gently build up the muscles in the baby's eyes because it's going to be improving their tracking skills and developing their focusing skills as well. To begin with, instead of laying them on their back where the bubbles may fall in their eyes, you might wish to put them on your lap or in a bumbo so that they can have a good look around. Another great option is tummy time. So if you put them on their tummy, they'll be lifting up and moving their head back and forth, having a good look around and building up the muscles ready for crawling. Your older ones will be reaching out, so encourage that pincer grip. You can also say things like pop, pop, pop to encourage those language skills. Your crawlers are going to be crawling around trying to pop those bubbles and your cruisers might even take their very first step. This is our six month activity. So we've got four sensory bags here. I'm going to show you how to do a fifth in a moment. So we've just got some pom-poms in a Ziploc bag. Some frozen peas to start exploring temperature. Some lentils, which are brilliant for mark making. And some water beads, which are lovely and squishy. So I'm going to show you how to make an oil and water sensory bag. You'll need two cups of oil, some food colouring and half a cup of water. So we're going to start by pouring two cups of oil into the Ziploc bag. Just pop it in a jug to keep it upright. So that's two cups of oil in the bag. And then we're going to mix half a cup of water with some food colouring of your choice. Today I've got red for older babies who might like to do a bag of the primary colours. So red in one bag, yellow in another and blue in another. And babies can enjoy exploring colours by overlaying the bags. I'm just going to tip that in there as well. I can already see it's starting to bubble there. I'm not sure if you can see. So, I'm going to take it out of the jug and create a seal, vacuum seal, by popping it in another bowl of water. So all the air is going to squidge out and we're going to just zip that bit up and there we have it. So you need to let that dry out or give it a wipe over and mix it up. I would suggest just taping along the seal so that it doesn't, if it did leak, then you've got a bit of a barrier there. You could also double bag it as well. But this is a great one for babies to be exploring the bubbles and the oil and the water together. So there we have it. There's our six month plus activity with the sensory bags. Lots to explore there. I'd love to see yours when you do. So I'm just going to take you around my texture trail. Firstly, we've got a lovely fluffy blanket. Then we've got a foil blanket. This is just from my next to me cot. It's got a lovely wooden solid top to it. And a big pillow, nice and cushioned. An oil cloth. If you haven't got an oil cloth, you could use your baby changing mat. A ribbed rug and a tunnel and obviously in between you've got all the grass so here I've got a tough spot if you don't have a tough spot you could use an inflatable paddling pool rolled up towels in a circle even cushions as long as you're closely monitoring baby supervising that's absolutely fine so we've got the tough spot underneath I've got a folded up towel that's just going to stop the middle from dipping down and all the balls rolling into the centre. 
and I've got a range of different balls, um, different textures, different shapes, different sizes, spiky ones, plastic, wooden, whatever you can get your hands on. So we're going to pop baby in the middle there and encourage them to be turning their head and reaching out to be playing with the balls. Just a little note to say that in the beginning, baby's not going to really enjoy tummy time just because they're not used to using those muscles and it's a bit like when you or I go to the gym it takes a while to build up the muscles to begin with it's very tiring um, a little bit achy so just take it with baby's lead if they're not enjoying it sit baby back up try again later on just little and often it's going to help building up those essential muscles for crawling later on